It is a women's bantamweight showdown between Holly Holm and Ronda Rousey. Alright, so here she is, United States Olympic medalist, former UFC women's bantamweight champion and Hall of Famer Ronda Rousey. You can't tell the history of women in mixed martial arts without starting with Ronda. It has to start with Ronda yeah. Rousey because her first UFC fight against Liz Carmouche back in Anaheim was truly, truly amazing. They went out there, they put on a great show. Ronda ended it in the most patented way. It had to end with an arm bar. Ronda got it at the end of the first round. The crowd went crazy. And you understood at that moment, if Ronda was a star prior, she was going to the moon after that night in Anaheim. And that's exactly what she did. She really has had a profound impact on American culture. Halloween rolls around yes. every year. Ronda Rousey's are everywhere. You can't effectively put into words her contribution to mixed martial arts. And of course, tonight, she will try to add to her legacy. All right, so here's the longtime Jackson Wink MMA staple, former UFC women's bantamweight champion Holly Holm, D.C. She's got the highlight of all highlights. She'll be looking to produce another one here tonight. That night she knocked out Ronda Rousey was absolutely insane because Ronda Rousey was still riding super hot. Nobody thought she had a chance. Set up that beautiful head kick just because, as always, Holly Holm will follow a game plan to a T. One of the smartest fighters in the entire UFC uses her brain, her skill, and her footwork in order to set traps for opponents, and then she strikes and strikes and finishes the fight. Holly Holm is a phenomenal fighter. And when her back has been up against the proverbial wall, she comes out and dominates someone like Megan Anderson, as she did back at UFC 225. Holly Holm chasing further greatness here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC bantamweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a judo fighter with a professional record of 12 wins, 2 losses. She stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Venice Beach, California, presenting the former UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion of the World, Rowdy Ronda Rousey! And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a boxer holding a professional record of 14 wins, 6 losses. She stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds, fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, Holly, the preacher's daughter! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. Herb Dean, our third man in the octagon for this one. Great. All right, here we go, round one, the classically trained striker versus the decorated grappler. A lot of people have compared this matchup to Amanda Nunes versus Ronda Rousey, and I think it's probably an appropriate comparison. Yes, it's very appropriate, because you remember, Amanda was always creating space and never being where Ronda expected her to be. So she needs to do the same thing. She's such a high-level striker. She has such a diverse array of skills in the striking that if her opponent, a jiu-jitsu fighter at her core, cannot get her hands wrapped around her, she's in for a very long night. And that one was heavy. And she connects with a punch there. We'll see if she can follow it up now. She's been landing at a super high rate. She's in a great flow right now. But don't take many of those. Oh, she landed a big knee to the body. Beautiful body to land right under the elbow. Wild attempt with the right hand there. Nice leg kick land. Big oh. knee lands there. Came of inches right there, Damn. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, big kick for her there. Oh, nice 
left, right hand. Oh, nice high kick. And just misses with that big right hand. Well, Rousey's shot is blocked. Whiffs on the elbow. You got to check these low leg kicks. Big kick land. Oh, how good was that right hand? Beautiful connection by her there. Right down the pipe, right on the chin. So just over 20 total strikes for Holly Holm. Oh, and there's another leg kick just out, right? I mean, now she has sort of rendered her opponent, as you see the damage, a, a one-legged fighter. She is fighting a one-legged fighter, a wounded gazelle right in front of a right. hungry lion. That is not a great position to be. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Rousey. Wow. That was a thudding leg and kick. And continues with the inside leg kick. Another big leg kick lands. Huge knee to the body. That'll soften her up. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Nice job by her there to block those shots. When you first go to a boxing class, the first thing they say is glue your guard to your face. Her guard's high tonight. Her guard's high, and she keeps the elbow down. She does a great job of blocking the top and down low. Rousey gets touched by that kick to the body. Oh, man, that looked like it hurt. Nice kick by her there. It absolutely did hurt. I can tell you that as a fact. 90 seconds now to go in this one. Oh, and she connects there. Beautiful punch. Oh, what a strike by her there. I'd be knocked out. Her opponent still stands. She's still standing, but she's got to get on her bike now. She's got to get out to the center of the octagon. Find some quick.
pace so that she can evade her opponent for finishing. Some nice back and forth action here. Great tempo to her striking game tonight. She is staying busy in a nice series of punches again there. She's in a great flow state. The hands are flowing, the head movement's going. She's doing a fantastic job. You love that flow state. I love it. Oh, and she lands another leg kick right on the target. If you're the opponent at this point, what do you do? Close the distance, make it a dog fight? You gotta do something. Oh, you gotta get close. You have to do something to change the way that this fight is taking its course. She is so comfortable now. Blasted leg kick. She's so confident that nothing different is coming in her direction. You gotta get close, John, fight chest to chest. Chest to chest, there are no leg kicks. Or try to get a takedown. Change a level. Time one of those kicks to grab it and run her over. You gotta do something. Trying to hammer that lead leg. <gasps> 15 seconds. Outstanding kick there by Holly Holm. Straight punch, and now her opponent's done. She can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. Right. Round two next. Well, a punch like that would have felled lesser women, but she survives and gets to fight another round. She's as tough as they come. She's sitting on her bench right now telling her coaches, I'm good. I'm ready to go. That was... You ready to fight? You ready? All right. Round two. Oh, that's a hell of a kick by her there. We'll see if she can follow it up now, champ. Great job landing that kick. Oh, is that a strike right there, DC? Great shot landed. Now she's got to go chase her down. She get another one off to finish the fight. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. All right, so her ground control is outstanding. Half guard is when she's at her most dangerous. Yeah, she's at her most dangerous when she has a half guard because she's so brutal with the ground and pound. She likes to go after fighters and really wear on them. Force them to make decisions to give their backs so that she can chase her submission, or they're gonna lay on their back and just get beaten up from the top from that beautiful half guard position. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Well, Rousey's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, look at the inside leg kick. Hold it now. Could be the beginning of the end, champ. She hurt her very badly with that big leg kick. Nice head kick. Just unable to quite find that range. Goodness gracious, she lands another head kick upstairs. That's what my grandmother says, goodness gracious. Over and over, she is landing that head kick like Grandma used to say. Goodness gracious. John, I'd like to meet your grandmother. She sounded like a sweet woman. Oh! Kick by her there. She just gets that foot off the canvas to the target so quick. She does not give her opponent any idea that that kick is coming. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Nice punch there by Holm. Wow. You can never know what you're going to see with this young lady. Is she going to finish the fight? That one was thrown to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> Her opponent's in a world of trouble. She landed that punch in the exact spot that she needed to. Well, she has certainly picked up the pace here in round two and starting to find herself in the pocket a little bit. She was a little bit hesitant in round one. No hesitancy whatsoever here in round two. She has clearly found her rhythm and range. That one snuck in. 
Nice strike. She hurt her very badly with that big leg kick. Well-placed kick there by Holly Holm. <laughs> Trying to establish that jab once again. <laughs> nice head kick. Oh, and she connects there, so the hands look good tonight. Great time to land that punch. She had the jab working tonight. Beautifully done on that exchange. She's got it going, and it's so fast and so accurate. She's really good at fighting behind her jab. It's a beautiful, fast, quick jab. Quick oh, beating. The inside leg kick. Could be the beginning of the end, Chad. She hurt her very badly with that big leg kick. Rousey gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense. Oh. So there's the horn, the round is over, and we've got more fighting. It looked like maybe we'd get a finish there after she landed upstairs. Well, she was excited. She thought it was done. How does she... Ready, fight. Ready. All right, five minutes to decide this one. I mean, that is a big shot to the head. I cannot believe she's still standing. Put together some significant body work here, and these are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Nice punch by Holm. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, that's a big hook to the chin. And she landed a kick there, DC. That was well done. Well done. She does a great job of recognizing the opening and getting the leg there. Oh! She is such a reverse striker. That dash big strike landed, and it looks like she's gonna finish it. Fight. Oh! Again, in the clinch. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. All right, so another swing and a miss, and I'd imagine if your gas tank is this low, you got to find times to try to preserve that and get yourself back to a place where you can actually dole out some damage. Yeah, you got to get out of space, find places to rest. Oh! You can never know what you're going to see with this young lady. Is she going to finish the fight? Oh! Whoa! Great movement by her here on the ground, and she just does it so fluidly and so easily. That'll do it! Do you believe it? She was not effectively defending herself, and the opponent was doing some real damage. It became a dangerous situation. I think it's the right call by the official, and she will live to fight another day. Inside the octagon, Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop in this contest at one minute, 33 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, Browning! Ronda Rousey! 
Save. Well, you see the raw emotions and the happiness out of her and her corner. What a result here tonight as she gets it done by now. I mean, she could not have imagined that it would go this well. I know she said it would happen, but when it does, I mean, it's joy. It's joy like nothing you've ever felt before. You don't expect it.